Our first speaker is a graduate of our nursing program. She'll be graduating with an Associate of Science degree. Please help me welcome Ms. Sadie Cross. Thanks, Russell. Hi, everyone. I'm Sadie. I only have a few minutes to talk tonight, so speaking of minutes, I want to talk about time. It's a tricky thing. So much of our lives are seemingly lived by the tick-tock of a clock. At the very beginning, we learn when it's time to nap, it's time to eat, it's time to brush your teeth. Soon after, we learn how to set time, to alarm us when to get up for school, when to switch classes, when to punch in and punch out. We count our birthdays, our grades, our degrees, our timesheets, our transcripts. Boy, we can really get focused on that clock. But right now, I'm gonna challenge all of you to see it a little differently with me. Lo and behold, there was no alarm clock that went off when I was 24 and said, ring, time to be a mom. There was no bell that rang when I was 34 that said, ding, ding, your marriage is done, time to get a divorce. There was no time clock to punch in when I walked through those doors out there to begin pursuing my nursing degree and living my truth. I want you to forget the clock and think about time with me as moments. Moments and experiences aren't driven by a tick and a talk, but by a lub-dub. That's your heartbeat, little nursing terminology in there. Our heart's timing doesn't have hours or minutes. It's measured by joys, by challenges, by surprises, and by triumphs. I'm so grateful that all of my moments led me to Fond du Lac Tribal and Community College. I'm thankful to be a part of this awesome institution that values the things that I truly believe in, like collaboration, diversity, loving Mother Earth, learning from science, and helping one another be the best we can be. I'm so proud that I can show my two daughters that it's possible to be a mom, a nurse, a student, an activist, a learner, and a leader. I say all this because I want you to take your moment right now. Think about the experiences that brought you here and think about your heart's timing. It's sometimes difficult, sometimes triumphant, but it is perfect for you. This is your time and your moment to be proud of your accomplishments and keep moving in the direction of your dreams. A wise person once said, the bad news is, time flies. The good news is, you're the pilot. So listen to the alarm clocks when you must. But more importantly, remember to listen to that tick-tock of your heart and you will do great things. Congratulations. Father, I'm going to be in college class of 2017.